All right, hot liquors, I'm back with another pedal review. Today we're going to review the Electro Harmonix Cockfight pedal, a drive pedal with the function of hooking up an expression pedal right here. And uh, you can use it as a wah pedal. And it has all these functions like a talk wah or a, a crybaby type of wah sound. Um, you got pre-fuzz off and post-fuzz off. Don't really know what that means, but it does make a huge difference in the sound of the amp. Or the pedal, rather. Through the amp, which is this little solid-state amp. You know, real shitty solid-state amp, but good enough for playing around the house. And, uh, you know, these are pretty hot pickups right here on, a, on this uh, SG. I've got the uh, EQ Midway, and i got a pretty good amount of drive here. For the sake of this um, demonstration, I may turn the drive off and go with a clean channel. But I normally wouldn't play that way. So I'll do both for the sake of the demonstration today. Let's start with the drive channel here. So uh, you got your volume, pedal, frequency, tone, and the drive, the amount of drive. Right now we're going to leave, uh, uh, these, we got these little uh, bias, uh, we've got a bias and a bottom pedal. Or, I mean, a, sorry, a knob, a bias knob and a bottom knob. I'm going to turn those off. And uh, we're going to go with pre. And uh, we're not going to, if you leave this in the middle, this little knob here, I assume it turns off the, the wah function at the frequency you just control with the, the knob here because we don't have a pedal hooked up. Let's check it out here. This is the amp. Not a lot of volume there. Let's turn the volume up. On well, the neck pickup right here. So, the bottom, let's see what that does. Oh, no, let's see what the frequency does first. Something's happening here. Oh, wow. Well. So that frequency all the way off there is, uh, you know. You can really trick your amp here. Tone knob, let's see what that does. All the way off. Midway. All the way up, not a whole lot of difference. Turn it back to the middle. The drive is already in the middle. We're not going to get a lot of character out of this pedal maybe until we turn this bottom. Let's see what it does. Oh, it gives us great uh, depth. Halfway for now. Well, just for the sake of this, the talk function does change the EQ tremendously. Oh well, that's a very sensitive knob right there. This may be a flaw in the, in the uh, pedal, but turn the talk down. Changes the EQ tremendously. Tremendously without an expression pedal. Let's mess with that frequency. You hear that? That may be because the bias is turned all the way off. That bias all the way up here. Back up to the, uh, oh well, back up to the neck pick up here. Get a lot of noise. Let's turn the tone knob off, see what it does.
All right, let's turn the drive back to halfway. Not a whole lot of notice, uh, noticeable difference between the drive being all the way up. That bias, let's turn it all the way. All right. I'm going to take the talk function, turn it back off. Go back to the dry function, which I, I assume would be a, no, you know, the regular wah function, maybe. Uh, oh, no, it's a cry. I, I read the wrong. That's not dry. Okay, we're going to turn it back to the middle, which is going to be uh, no effect at all. Hopefully, the EQ or frequency EQ does still work. I think I'm going to like it somewhere around a third of the way up. This bias is going to be cool to mess with here. Let's go. That was in pre. Let's go uh, f fuzz. Then the post fuzz part here. We're down here in the bridge pickup, so a lot cleaner tone already. This is without the pedal. Sounds pretty damn good. It volume's all the way up almost. Not a lot of power on this pedal, I've noticed. Uh, you, you're halfway, you got nothing. Until you turn it almost all the way up. Frequency still works. Drive, let's turn it all the way up. That's a strong tone right there. Without the pedal. Let's turn the, uh, the tone knob all the way off. Halfway up. All the way on the tone. Let's back off the drive a little bit here. Still a lot of drive right there to be uh, backed off a little bit. Halfway here. The bias is all the way up, by the way. We'll get to the bias here in a minute. I haven't messed with this uh, bottom switch. Without the pedal. Let's go back to the halfway of the frequency here. All the way of the frequency. So far, this pedal, I can say, is pretty versatile. Let's mess with this bias. I'm going to turn everything back to the middle here, as far as the tone and the frequency. The bottom here, let's mess with that with the, with the tone of frequency in the middle. All the way up. great fuss sound. This could be a fuss pedal. This could take the place of uh, maybe uh, one of those big muff pedals. They have a hundred of them now. Take the bottom all the way off. Let's mess with this bias now. It biases all. Let's turn it all the way off. It 
is that is that a precise sound? Uh, let's listen to just hitting this uh, open D or E chord. Half, that's halfway on the bias. Let's go back up here to this neck pickup. Tone all the way off. Bias duo on the uh, neck pickup with the tone all the way off. That bottom's turned all the way up, turn it uh, halfway here. A lot of possibilities with this. It's safe to say the post sounds way better than the pre. Sounds like a wah pedal kind of sitting in the, in the middle somewhere. Back to the post. Let's try to get a maximum fuzz to really compete with the, the big muff sound. Volume pedal I'm going to leave alone. Tone I'm going to go about three-fourths the way up here. Drive I'm going to go almost all the way. Let's turn that bottom all the way up. The bias, turn right in the middle. Let's go to the bridge pickup. Let's turn this bias all the way up, bottom halfway. Back to the bottom all the way up. A lot of noise on this pedal when you turn the drive all the way up. As you can hear it right here, so the more we back off the drive, that noise goes away. Go back to the bridge pickup here. Let's turn that frequency about, oh, you see you can hear, you can hear what an expression pedal would do. Turn the drive back up. Go up to the next pickup, tone all the way up. That bias has a lot of a uh, lot of uh, effect here. Bias all the way off right here. Bias all the way up here. A lot of noise. Let's, let's turn the uh, distortion off on the amp. What we got here is a clean channel of the amp. Kind of sounds like shit. I like my drive as the backing. Now if you play the clean uh, you know, through a clean uh, sound all the time, except for when you hit the drive pedal. You would need to set this up to, to work with your amp. 
Maybe turn the tone knob off here. You could get every kind of drive sound, or fuzz sound rather, out of this pedal, I'm convinced. It's a great pedal for fuzz. For $92, you can't beat it. Everybody should have one of these on their board. It's a great pedal. I'm Cody, talking about the Cockfight, a wonderful pedal from Electro Harmonix, a great company. And they're not paying me for this, by the way. And I bought the pedal. I would love to do more of these, and I intend to do something in the future. Thank you for watching Hot Licks.